ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, thank you for coming back. It is another Thursday and you are back. I am back. We are all back for another episode of Impact Pro Wrestling, this time in Fort Worth, Texas. And we have a great show planned for all of you tonight. All right, ladies and gentlemen, now this is part one of four of the great show we have planned for you. This is part one. This is match number one. It is going to be an extreme rules match between Prince Morrison and Eddie Danger. Ladies and gentlemen, this is part two of four of the great show we have planned for all of you tonight. It will be the heartbreaker versus the phenomenal one. It will be Tommy Hart versus Peter Young. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this will be part three. This will be match number three. We are going to see the golden one, Heath Gold, go one-on-one -on -one against the number one contender for the Impact Pro Wrestling Television Championship. The man that will get his championship match. Come two weeks at our next pay-per-view known as Power Struggle. We are going to see DJ Summers and Heath Gold go one-on-one. -on -one. Another opportunity for DJ Summers to gain momentum heading into his match at Power Struggle for the championship. We will see if he is successful in his attempt to gain momentum in part number three. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the final part of the epic show we have planned for you. This is the main event of the evening. We are going to see the amazing one, Mr. Amazing, go one-on-one -on -one with the hitman of IPW, known as Doc Adams. This is our main event. Now, you already know the four parts of the show that we have planned for you, but now it is finally time to start the show. And we're going to start the show off extremely with an Extreme Rules match between Prince Morrison and Eddie Danger. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for our first match of the evening and our first match of the evening as you all know does involve this man walking down to the ring right now in full view and we all know this man to be Prince Morrison now we saw Prince Morrison a little while ago here on Impact Pro Wrestling and we're gonna see him again trying to pick up another victory this time over Eddie Danger now, this, of course, is not a normal matchup where the referee will count to 10 if you are outside of the ring. This is not a normal matchup where if you hit your opponent with a steel chair, a sledgehammer, a table, a ladder, one of the monitors from the announce table, you will be disqualified and lose the match. This is a match where both of those things are perfectly okay. If you are outside the ring, the referee will not count to 10. If you are outside of the ring, or inside the ring for that matter, and you hit your opponent with a weapon that is not your fist, your knees, or your feet, you will not be disqualified. This is a match of extreme rules. Anything goes. The only rules that apply in this matchup is that you have to win through pinfall or submission, and those pinfalls or submissions have to be done inside the ring. It's going to be a... Guaranteed epic matchup between Prince Morrison who is currently inside the ring and this man walking down to the ring right now That we all know to be Eddie Danger. We know that Eddie Danger has been performing a lot here at Impact Pro Wrestling And he's been performing to some great extent impressing a lot of the fans of Impact Pro Wrestling and a lot of the guys backstage Eddie Danger really showing his stuff so to speak and we will see him show his stuff once again, this time against Prince Morrison. We'll see which one of these men can win this Extreme Rules match. Eddie Danger or Prince Morrison. I gotta say right now, ladies and gentlemen, my vote is all for Eddie Danger. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is about to start. That's Eddie Danger. That is Prince Morrison. And this match has officially begun with that ring of the bell. Eddie Danger starting off the match nicely with that nice belly to belly suplex.
Overhand shot right there. Avoided. Now, Prince Morrison delivering a nice move right there. Eddie and Prince Morrison going at it here. Prince Morrison just shoving Eddie Daniels' face right into that mat. Big kick to the chest right there by Prince Morrison. Now Prince going outside of the ring here. Looking underneath the ring. It looks like he's found a kendo stick, ladies and gentlemen. But, oh, look at that. Looks like Eddie Danger has gotten that kendo stick away from Prince. And he delivers a huge shot right to the back. Looks like Eddie's done with the kendo stick. Eddie's not a kendo stick kind of guy, but he did get all the damage he could get out of that with it. Prince Morrison trying to fight back with that big punch to the gut. Now the running arm drag. But Eddie Danger fighting back too. Not able to gain control though. Prince Morrison sending Eddie to those ropes. Going for the drop kick but avoided by Eddie Danger. Going for some kind of Samoan drop maybe. But Prince Morrison able to fight back with those strong elbows. Now Prince delivering that nice Spinning complete shot. Jumping elbow drop right here. And now Prince Morrison setting up a danger for Snake Eyes. And we see Prince Morrison got that table here. Sending that table inside the ring. Now these men continuing to go at it. Now a table inserted into the mix. Looks like Eddie Danger gonna send Prince Morrison to the center of that ring. Pinfall right here. Not sure if Eddie Danger meant to do that or not, but Eddie Danger sending that table outside of the ring. That table no longer in play, or at least not in the ring. Now Eddie Danger delivering one nice clothesline right here to Prince Morrison. Another nice clothesline. And here comes clothesline number three, ladies and gentlemen. Three great clotheslines right there by Eddie Danger. Eddie going outside of the ring, going underneath the ring. Looks like he's going to go exploring. And it looks like Eddie Danger is picking up a ladder here, ladies and gentlemen. But Prince Morrison able to stop Eddie Danger before he could execute whatever plan he had there. These two men continuing the fight here inside the ring, weaponless. Both men stopping each other before weapons can really be inserted and used. Eddie Danger showing off a great stalling vertical squatting suplex. Pinfall attempt right here. But Prince Morrison able to kick out. Now Eddie Danger, he's about to fly. But he wants Prince Morrison on his feet first so he can fly with that double axe handle. But unfortunately, Prince Morrison was able to reverse it, delivering a huge shot right to the gut. Now look at this. Prince Morrison delivering a huge shot to the back of the head with that steel chair. Kendo sticks, steel chairs, ladders, and tables have been inserted so far, ladies and gentlemen. And these two men doing some push and pull when it comes to which one of these men is in dominant control. Currently, Prince Morrison but Eddie Danger fighting back with that nice European uppercut. And now, Eddie Danger delivering some hard shots right to the face. Pinfall right here by Eddie Danger, but Prince Morrison able to kick out. Now Eddie going outside the ring once again, looking for some kind of weapon. You're looking for a new toy. And he's found a sledgehammer, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and look at that sledgehammer being slammed right into the gut of Prince Morrison. And you can see Eddie Danger trying to take advantage of all the torso damage he's applied to Eddie Danger as he applies his clover leaf. Legs are a lot. The knee is on the back and Eddie Danger is wrenching it indeed. But Prince Morrison able to fight through the pain and blow Eddie Danger off of him. It's like 
Eddie Danger gonna suffer for that submission attempt here as Prince Morrison may be gaining the upper hand here. Now Prince Morrison taking a page out of Eddie Danger's book, the submission book. We went from a clover leaf to a cross face here. But Eddie Danger fighting out of it with a big knee to the back of the head and then a big punch square to the face. A slam here attempted, but Prince Morrison able to reverse, turning it into a reverse DDT. Oh, look at that. Eddie Danger delivering a huge clothesline right there to Prince Morrison. Now, Eddie setting up Prince on his shoulders. Torture, rack, back, stabba. Eddie Danger delivering those huge double knees, getting on that uh, that those second rope. He's trying to get the fans on his side. And now Eddie turning right back to Prince Morrison, sending him to the outside of the ring with that huge clothesline. Now what does Eddie have planned here? Oh, big DDT on the outside of the ring. Now Eddie. Picking up Prince and taking him all around the world. And setting him down right back here. That airplane spin, ladies and gentlemen. Not a move that tends to end matches, but a move that does hurt your opponents in its own special little way. Pinfall right here by Eddie Danger. And it looks like that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Eddie Danger is your winner. One, two, and three. Here we see some of the great highlights of this matchup. That great vertical suplex. And an Eddie Danger delivering these strong punches. Including this right here. This torture rack backstabber. And this right here. I think this is the ending of the match really. This hard DDT on the outside of the ring. Great match here by Eddie Danger. Showing off his great repertoire. And his great showing here. This is an Extreme Rules match. Part 1 of this epic show. That we have planned for you all tonight is done and Eddie Danger stands on top of part one ladies and gentlemen. Now ladies and gentlemen it is time for part two of this epic show. It will be the phenomenal one Peter Young against the heartbreaker Tommy Hart. Alright ladies and gentlemen. It is time for our second match of the evening, and it will involve this man walking down to the ring right now. This man is the phenomenal one, Peter Young. Now, we've seen Peter Young here in Impact Pro Wrestling really uh, change his attitude and change his demeanor, change his actions. This change entirely here in Impact Pro Wrestling before, we always knew he was cocky. Peter Young always been a cocky guy, but over the past few weeks, Peter Young has been attacking anybody that he pleases with no no mercy nor any uh, any explanation about why he's doing what he's doing. He's still just as cocky, still doing what he would do, but now being much more aggressive and much more violent with his actions. We're not sure what's going on in the head of the phenomenal one. Now Peter Young is in the ring, and here comes his opponent right now. Here comes the heartbreaker, Tommy Hart. And one's got to wonder what's on Tommy Hart's mind. Tommy Hart has got to be seeing what Peter Young has been doing over the past couple of weeks. And Tommy Hart's got to be aware, and it's got to be a little bit nervous on some level. Peter Young has been a ruthless man for these past couple of weeks, but we will see if that will continue here tonight. We'll see if Tommy Hart can put an end to the ruthlessness of Peter Young here. Now this is Tommy Hart in the ring, and this matchup is just ready to go. Tommy Hart and Peter Young, this matchup is just about to begin, ladies and gentlemen. Now that is the phenomenal one, and that is the heartbreaker. And this match 
has officially begun between Tommy Hart and Peter Young. We will see which one of these men will come out victorious. Peter Young starting off this match with that nice move right there on Tommy Hart. Quick pinfall attempt right here by Peter Young. Able to get one, but Tommy Hart able to kick out almost immediately. Nice overhand shot right there. Northern Lights suplex delivered right there by Peter Young now. Peter Young delivering that nice fist drop. Peter Young getting Tommy Hart on his feet. Delivering two nice kicks and one good clothesline, ladies and gentlemen. You can see Peter Young being very aggressive here, going right after Tommy Hart. Back suplex face buster, great move right there by Peter Young. Now Peter Young climbing up to that tippity top rope. Going for the leg drop, but Tommy Hart able to avoid it. Now Tommy Hart sending Peter Young to those ropes and delivering a huge forearm shot. And you can see Tommy Hart just slamming Peter Young's face into the canvas. Peter Young fighting back with a big elbow shot and then a combination of great strikes right there by Peter Young. Peter Young trying to go for a stomp here, but Tommy Hart fighting back, taking that boot of Peter's and tripping him up, sending him face first into the canvas. Pinfall right here, but not even a one count, as Peter Young was able to kick out almost immediately. Back suplex attempted, reverse right there by Peter Young, and Peter Young delivering that nice move right there. Great knee to the back of the head. Nice slam right there by the Phenomenal One. And now, the Phenomenal One delivering that nice elbow drop with a little bit of pizzazz at the very end of it. Pinfold right here. But Tommy Hart able to kick out. Tommy Hart able to dodge that kick right there by Peter Young with Peter Young. Fighting against Tommy Hart. Reversal. Turning whatever Tommy had planned into a nice suplex. Tommy Hart trying to climb himself up there outside on the apron. But Peter Young sending him all the way to the outside of the ring here, ladies and gentlemen. Now Tommy Hart back on his feet and Peter Young not going to pursue. Tommy Hart getting a minute here to rest. Now Tommy getting back into the ring. And Peter Young still in control here. Look at this. Tommy, though, finally able to escape Peter Young's grasp right there. Attacking that leg, gaining the advantage. And now Tommy Hart could get the momentum here. Great knee right there by Tommy Hart. Tommy Hart going for the pinfall here. But Peter Young able to kick out almost immediately still. Great move right there, attempted. Great shot right there, attempted by Tommy Hart, but avoided by Peter Young, and Peter Young taking that advantage to deliver these German suplexes. Three piece. Now Peter Young setting up for the P D T, the phenomenal D T. And Peter Young is not done yet as he continues his assault right here. Great arm drag right there by the Phenomenal One. And now the Phenomenal One measuring the Heartbreaker. He's got that arm, he's up, and he is young forever. The finishing move by Peter Young. Pinfall attempt right here, that's one, that's two. But Tommy Hart showing guts and power here as he was able to kick out at two but the question is did that do more harm than good Peter Young can't be happy about that kick out but Tommy Hart trying to still fight here with that Irish whip sending Peter Young into that corner now sitting up on the top rope and Tommy Hart setting up Peter Young for that great back suplex
Tommy Hart delivering that great senton from the second rope. Peter Young, nice reversal right there. Big punch to the gut and a big forearm shot. Now Peter Young taking a moment in that corner. Figuring out his game plan now. Just staring down at his work. You got to know that Tommy Hart is not a man at 100% right now. He's got to be at, like, at, at least 75 here. At the very most, 76. You can see Peter Young still on the attack here, slamming the back of Tommy Hart's neck right into that turnbuckle. And here it comes. Peter Young just stomping and stepping on the chest of Tommy Hart. Tommy Hart facing the full impact of that punch to the side of the head. And now Peter reverse DDT. Pinfall right here by Tommy Hart. Tommy Hart able to kick out. Peter Young pinfall attempt not successful. Now Peter Young doing one more reverse DDT. Getting Tommy Hart on his feet to send them back down to the mat with a nice snapmare. And now using this great headlock right here. Looks like P.D. Young trying to slow down the pace of this match here. P.D. Young applying this headlock of Tommy Hart, slowing down the pace. But you can see Tommy Hart trying to fight out of it. Headlock of his own, but letting Peter go. Irish whip, sending Peter Young into that corner. Big chop in the corner. Irish whip, rebound. And look at this. Tommy Hart with that great move right there, gaining the advantage. Look at this. Great move right there by Tommy Hart. The full Nelson bomb. He switched, he turned, and he set him down on the ground. Pinfall, but Peter Young able to kick out before the three count. Now look at this, Tommy Hart is measuring Peter Young. Going for something here, maybe going for the heartbreaker, the signature, the finishing move here, that submission hole, but Peter Young was able to escape it here. Or escape whatever Tommy had planned. Now look at this, Tommy Hart needs to stay down because Peter Young is measuring him for his finishing move once again, Young. Forever. Pinfall attempt right here by Peter. That's one. That's two. But Tommy Hart still kicking out. And you gotta know that that is not a very happy mood right now for Peter Young. Peter Young cannot be happy about that. Peter Young going up to the second rope here. Going for that rolling set up. But Tommy Hart able to avoid it. Pinfall right here. Peter Young able to kick out here. Now Tommy Hart trying to apply this shoulder claw. Tommy Hart going up to the second rope here. And he's trying to fly. With that nice second rope DDT. A great offensive maneuver right there by Tommy Hart. Oh, look at this, Peter Young blocking that strike, but Tommy Hart still able to get control here. Tommy Hart delivering that great back suplex right there to the phenomenal one. Looks like Tommy Hart is indeed gaining the advantage, gaining all of it here. Peter Young trying to fight back here with that big kick and then these strong punches. Now Peter Young getting Tommy up on his feet, going for a move here, but Tommy able to reverse it. Tommy delivering that great belly to belly here. Pinfall right here by Tommy Hart. He's got one. Peter Young able to kick out, however. You can see Tommy Hart fighting hard here. 
And you can see Tommy now just raking his wrist and his forearm right across the face of Peter Young. Peter Young able to avoid whatever Tommy had planned there. And Peter Young delivering a nice knee to the back of the head. Peter Young going outside on the apron, going for a springboard move here. Springboard cross body on Tommy Hart. Pin four right here by the phenomenal one after that cross body, but he's only able to get two. Now Tommy Hart getting dealt the full impact of that reverse DDT. Now, looks like Peter Young gonna set up Tommy for something here. Gonna set him up with a buckle bomb. Power bomb position, and then just slamming him right into that turnbuckle. Now, Peter Young, looks like he's gaining control here, setting up Tommy Hart on the top rope. Setting up for a top rope cutter. Great move right there by the Phenomenal One. Now, the Phenomenal One. Dragging Tommy Hart center that ring pinfall attempt. He's got one. That's two, but Tommy Hart able to kick out. Peter Young on that second rope. Measuring Tommy Hart. Ah, oh, look at that right there. The blockbuster was avoided. Here comes Tommy once again. The standing switch full Nelson bomb. Oh, look at that. Tommy Hart delivering a big kick right to the gut. And looks like he's got it locked in this time, ladies and gentlemen. That was, those legs are wrapped around Peter Young's neck. And Peter Young's got to tap out. And ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner. He is the heartbreaker. He is Tommy Hart. Great showing here by both of these men. Tommy Hart putting on one hell of a show here, kicking out of two finishing moves right there by Peter Young. Young forever, not delivered once, but delivered twice. And Tommy Hart able to kick out both times. All it took was one heartbreaker, the legs wrapped around the neck, choking Peter Young, and it was an instant tap-out situation. A great match here performed by both men, and congratulations to Tommy Hart on his victory here tonight. Looks like the aggression that we talked about earlier by Peter Young just wasn't enough. Looks like Tommy Hart came prepared for that victory. Great match here by Tommy Hart and congratulations on a huge victory over Peter Young. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is our third match of the evening. We are gonna see DJ Summers go one-on-one -on -one with Heath Gold. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our next match of the evening. It's going to be this man, the most entertaining man in IPW that we all know as DJ Summers going one-on-one -on -one with Heath Gold. DJ getting ready for his match with Heath and DJ getting ready for his match in two weeks against the Impact Pro Wrestling Television Champion known as uh, Jackson Wright, who's coming down here with a sledgehammer. Oh, God! Now, we did have this question looming over all of us. If, uh, if, if Heath Gold was going to be able to stop the momentum that DJ Summers has been accumulating here over the past couple of weeks. But it looks like now we don't have to have that, that question. It looks like Jackson Wright plans to stop the momentum. Jackson right now just taunting DJ Summers and taunting all these fans here in attendance. DJ Summers now taking off his jacket trying to fight back. It looks like he's just not going to have the ability to do so.
Jackson right in DJ Summers on the stage here Jackson's got DJ up oh look at this but DJ fighting off Jackson with those strong strikes but DJ is just a little bit just not good enough right now I, I hate to say that but you can obviously see Jackson right taking full control here now Jackson's got DJ up once again for a power bomb on the mat referee standing in the ring not a whole lot he can really do here these men are just going at it looks like it's all Jackson right oh look at this now Jackson just he's doing a little bit too much right now just raking the face of DJ Summers here now it looks like DJ's about to go for one more ride Jackson Wright got him up and Jackson Wright powerbomb on the apron and is slamming him right into that apron one more time now DJ trying to fight back here looks like DJ and Jackson Wright gonna have themselves a brawl here DJ with a nice DDT ladies and gentlemen if you if you do not know for whatever reason this matchup is not official in any sense of the word oh look at that great move right there by Jackson right here this match is not even supposed to be happening this isn't even a match it's just a brutal assault here that took place by Jackson Wright Looks like DJ Summers trying to turn this assault in his favor, though. Trying to get the advantage here. Now DJ getting Jackson on his feet. But Jackson here trying. Delivering a nice reversal right there. Looks like Jackson going outside. Looking underneath. Oh, God. Looking underneath the ring and grabbing that sealed chair. Going for a shot here, but misses. Oh, but he didn't miss the second shot. And shots being taken right here. Here comes the fall away. Slam right on that chair, ladies and gentlemen. And Jackson Wright going at it one more time with DJ Summers with that chair. DJ Summers has got to be hurt here, ladies and gentlemen. Those chair shots are not anything to laugh at. Oh, look at this. Going for a headshot here, but DJ Summers fighting back. Maybe not well enough, though. Oh, look at this. DJ Summers still trying to fight back. But it's just not enough here. Now, look at Jackson now. Taunting DJ Summers up to his feet. One practice swing. And now a real swing. And those chair shots just keep on coming, ladies and gentlemen. Now that chair outside the ring, and what's Jackson got planned next? Oh, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Jackson Wright trying to measure DJ Summers here. Oh, and look at this. Here comes the bad pile driver. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to go to commercial for a minute here and try to get some help out here for DJ Summers.
ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, what Jackson Red is talking about in, uh, in the context of what just happened during the commercial break. As you see, we have uh, medical staff coming down here trying to get DJ Summers out of here. Wheeling him out if you're on a stretcher, of course, this is what uh, Jackson Wright was just referring to. As you can see him celebrating in the background, it's DJ Summers has put on that stretcher and is being taken to the back. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is our main event of the evening. Uh, we will check in on DJ Summers. I don't know if, if we will have an update before the end of the show, but we will try our best to give you that update. Now, ladies and gentlemen, regardless, the show must go on, and this is our final match of the night. This is our main event. Mr. Amazing and Doc Adams will go one-on-one -on -one coming up next. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our main event of the evening. It will be this man right here, Impact Pro Wrestling's very own resident hitman. We know him and you know him as Doc Adams. Doc Adams will be going one-on-one -on -one here with Mr. Amazing. And uh, I'm not too sure about Doc Adams here. Now, we've never really seen Doc Adams become very passionate on IPW. He's never really been a man who seems like he really knows what he wants here. Seems like he's only here for a paycheck, but Doc Adams got to know that if he were to obtain a victory here over Mr. Amazing, that would look great for him in terms of uh, him getting a future championship opportunity, whether that be for the television championship or for the Impact Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. We'll see what Doc Adams will be able to do here. He is a hitman, so I am not expecting a one-and-done five-minute match. That we'll see what Doc Adams and Mr. Amazing can perform in this ring. Now that is Doc Adams, and he is awaiting for his opponent here. We are only waiting now for Mr. Amazing, ladies and gentlemen. You can see these fans on their feet, excited to see Mr. Amazing. And here he is, ladies and gentlemen. Here is Mr. Amazing. Mr. Amazing coming down to ringside. You gotta believe Mr. Amazing is prepared for this matchup. Doc Adams is no easy opponent, so Mr. Amazing is gonna have to have a real good matchup and a real fight here to pull out a victory. And I think that's exactly what Mr. Amazing is going to need. He's gonna have to fight every step of the way if what he said last week is going to be true about the future of Impact Pro Wrestling being amazing. It's going to have to be all a fight here for Mr. Amazing. It's going to have to start tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Now that's Mr. Amazing, of course. Doing just a little bit more showboating before this matchup begins. It's going to be a real fight, ladies and gentlemen. Doc Adams and Mr. Amazing going head to head. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, this match underway, and you can see Doc Adams immediately going after Mr. Amazing with that Lufes press. It looks like the strategy here is aggression, but Mr. Amazing has that aggression scouted as he's able to reverse with that back body drop. And now, Amazing delivering that nice reverse DDT. And Amazing, some clubbing blows right to Doc Adams. Mr. Amazing got Doc Adams on one knee. Doc Adams, nice reversal right there. And now the big clothesline sending Mr. Amazing all the way to the outside of the ring. And Doc Adams going after Amazing. Going to go follow as he delivers that nice elbow drop. Nice forearm shot right there by Mr. Amazing. Mr. Amazing is going to slam Doc Adams' face right into that apron here. These two men now fighting on the outside of the ring here. But of course, this is not a false count anywhere match. You can see the referee counting inside the ring. Currently at a count of six. These men have got to get back into the ring. Now Mr. Amazing back in and Doc Adams following. And this match will continue as it was intended to on the inside of the ring. Doc Adams in control or maybe not for long. Mr. Amazing sending Doc Adams outside to the apron. But pulling Doc Adams back into the ring with that DDT. Mr. Amazing got Doc Adams in that headlock and now delivering that flatliner. Now, just as Mr. Amazing will do and has done, Doc Adams going outside of the ring, trying to take a little breather here, but Mr. Amazing going right after Doc. Big body shot and a Northern Light suplex outside of the ring, and these men were going head-to-head -head one more time. Big clothesline on the outside of the ring. Doc Adams, though, dragging Mr. Amazing, slamming Mr. Amazing right on that apron here. And Doc going to rake the back of Mr. Amazing. But Mr. Amazing turning around quickly, delivering that nice backbreaker. But Doc Adams throwing Mr. Amazing back into the ring. Mr. Amazing using those ropes to climb back up to his feet. But Doc Adams going right after him before he can get to his feet. Big knee to the back. And Mr. Amazing hugging himself now thanks to the help of Doc Adams. Doc Adams got that knee on the back. And he is wrenching it, doing some real damage to that back of Mr. Amazing. Mr. Amazing fighting out of this. Now Mr. Amazing taking some time to show up to the fans. Looks like Doc, I'm just going to stand there for a moment. Looks like both men knew exactly what's going to happen here. Looks like Doc Adams maybe had a plan to Mr. Amazing a little bit too quick. Able to get Doc Adams on his shoulders, deliver that stun gun. And now Mr. Amazing second rope going for the shoulder block with Doc Adams able to avoid it. Mr. Amazing, great knee right to the throat as a reversal. Now Doc Adams on one knee here. Thanks to the help of Mr. Amazing. And Amazing going to lift up Doc to the skies. And slam him down right on his knee for that great rib breaker. Pinfall attempt right here by Mr. Amazing. He's got one. That's two. But Doc Adams able to kick out. Now you can see Mr. Amazing just raking that forearm across the face of Doc Adams. And Mr. Amazing setting up for the leg drop on the arm. On that arm with the sleeve of Doc Adams. Doc Adams still trying to fight back here. Big shot to the gut. But you can see Mr. Amazing going for an Oklahoma Slam perhaps. But Doc Adams able to reverse. Turning that into a Russian leg sweep. Now Doc. Reverse suplex. Great move right there by Doc Adams. Now Doc going to go for a nice body splash on Mr. Amazing. Sitting Mr. Amazing up. Big kick to the back, completely tanked by Mr. Amazing here. And he goes for a slam, and Doc Adams once again able to avoid it and turning it into a nice backstabber. Pinfall attempt right here by 
Doc Adams, but Mr. Amazing able to kick out. Big shot to the back of the neck here. And Doc Adams setting up Amazing for the reverse DDT. Now, Doc Adams delivering that nice running body splash. Oh, you can see this right here. Mr. Amazing having that knee pinned on the back of his head and Doc Adams doing a little bit of taunting here. We never said anything about Doc Adams not being a cocky guy. Doc Adams now taking Mr. Amazing, setting him up against those ropes. Going for something here, but Mr. Amazing trying to fight back. Big shot, big chop. Mr. Amazing's got Doc Adams. Fisherman neckbreaker. Now you can see Mr. Amazing setting up Doc Adams with this reverse DDT here. And it looks like Mr. Amazing is going to measure Doc Adams. Doc Adams getting up to his feet for Amazing. Here comes Mr. Amazing with the finishing move. He calls this born amazing. Pinball right here. We have one, we have two, and we have three, ladies and gentlemen. Your winner. His name is Mr. Amazing, ladies and gentlemen, in an excellent matchup. Here we see some of the excellent moves that we've had throughout this matchup. The great rib breaker, for example, Mr. Amazing getting the full impact of this backstabber. It was an excellent match from both men, both Doc Adams and Mr. Amazing. But the end was signified first here and then here. Fisherman neckbreaker, born amazing. Pinfall attempt, it was all over from there. It was a great match performed by Doc Adams, but Mr. Amazing was just too amazing on this night, ladies and gentlemen. And that amazingness gave him the victory. And it gave him more momentum going into his matchup in two weeks at Power Struggle. Now look at this, ladies and gentlemen. We have someone on the entrance ramp here. Ladies and gentlemen, you can see right now, here comes Justice. And he looks like he's not dressed to fight, but he is dressed to talk here. Looks like Justice is going to have some words for Mr. Amazing. Coming down the entrance ramp right now, we're going to see what those words are. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like we've just heard two different sides of the future. Mr. Amazing and his amazing future in justice and his future filled with revolution. But the question is, in two weeks at Power Circle, which future will begin? An amazing future or a future of revolution?